Are you keeping up with the Kardashians? I just found out that Kim Kardashian is pregnant. Holy shit. That is some crazy. <laughs> it's kind of one of those things when like, kids in junior high and asked to be a dude. He's like, dude, what? Your mom's a porn star. No, she's not, dude. Yes, yeah, she is, dude. Check out the video. Mommy! My friend said you did a dirty sex day. Was that true? Oh my god, I can't believe you. Oh my god. Well, you see, your mom was young and horny and, you know, whatever. Man. Some people just shouldn't produce. Like myself, for instance. One of me's bad enough. Imagine a whole world of God the King Cobra's popping around, pipes in the mouth, telling people to fuck the mainstream. <gasps> yeah. uh, I just, oh my God. <sighs> mm, Boston Shirley Lager's delicious. Now I would be drinking out the bottle, except when I went to open the bottle, this happened. Oh well. Anyway, I'm gonna hop on a lot as the kid goes up and goes, What's this? Keeping up the Kardashians reruns only on E Classic Shows 2028. What the fuck is this shit? Oh my god, mommy, you're on TV. Yes, honey. But how'd you get so famous? Well, you see, um, my, uh, you're. Your grandfather, you didn't know him in life, but you know, um, he had defended O.J. Simpson, you know, and, um, helped him get off scot-free, and then, uh, got cancer and died, and it was really sad, and then E. gives us a TV show, and now we're famous. We got on a clothing store and everything, and, um, yeah. I don't know, and I just, um... Uh, now, here's the thing. How do I know all this? Quite frankly, there's something to do on nothing to watch on TV. Fuck it. Trash your TV show. <sighs> Sit there. Prepare for your mind to rot. <clears throat> yes, as we search the filter on the cigarette. What of it? So, here's the thing. These celebrity people have kids. It's like, really? Their mistakes, their friends give them shit about? Um, wow, people. It's just, wow. And how did I know this? Because I was watching The Simpsons. And it's weird because growing up, I never cared for The Simpsons. I thought that was kind of lame. I've always been a bigger fan of the Family Guy, uh, Cleveland Show, Bob's Burgers, shows like that. But um, there weren't any new episodes of the shows I usually watch on Hulu, so I was like, fuck it, I'll watch The Simpsons. And I'm starting to appreciate it somewhat. It's got, you know, it's plot lines. But, yeah. Uh, what else is to watch on Hulu? Oh, look at that. Nothing. Shocking, I know. Well. Anyway, if you don't believe me, we go to Hulu.com. I don't have Hulu Plus. I just, yeah. Okay, speaking of Hulu, this is what's pissing me off about Hulu. They say, this program is brought to you in part by limited commercial interruption by Geico. Okay, anything like all this is Geico. One commercial? Fine. No. You get Verizon, they just change a Massacre movie, a fucking Reese's commercial, then a Geico commercial. And then maybe a Verizon commercial, just for shits and giggles. You think, holy fuck. Now granted, it keeps Hulu free to some extent. And without the commercials, Hulu is losing money. People viewing all the popular shows on TV for free. So Hulu decided, hmm, what well, some advertising. Get ourselves some sponsors, make our shit look good. Okay, they got that figured out. So wants to make enough money. So now they're trying to do Hulu Plus, which is basically like Netflix. It's just, you don't have to go through the process of ordering in the mail and going, holy fuck, it's scratched. I'm shocked. You do that, you're gonna, seriously. My dad and mom used to get Netflix, and they get it in the mail. And they get one DVD in the mail, 
scratched his shit. Like, what the fuck is it? So we said, you know what? So they said, fuck that. They went with the Wii Netflix. So much easier, more convenient. Because it's like, chick. Oh, look at that. It's in a queue. Awesome. You're paying eight bucks a month, and why not? You have a somewhat limited selection. Now, granted, there's some movies I wanted to see on Netflix, but why don't you go look for them? They weren't listed. What? Um, oh, yeah, that was a fart. It's not a daily second. All right. Call the, G- the Jesus part. Prepare for a second coming. What if Jesus Christ was in a porno? Jesus Christ, is a super porn star. You write this. Prepare for my second coming. <laughs> yeah. Wow. We ran him for 4:31 in the morning. Anyway, back to Hulu and the story that I saw. Hulu goes, how would you like to view your commercials? Um, I'm thinking Geico, not a community, and he gets one of the community. You're like, what the fuck? You lying bastards. Okay, let's see, where the fuck was it? Maybe it's in the history. Uh, ah, it is. Okay, want to play it for you? E News confirms it. The fuck? The following clip is brought to you by Toyota. Kim Kardashian is pregnant. Oh my god, really? Who cares? Hey guys, I'm Terrence J. E News has officially confirmed Kim K is a... This thing that pisses me off about celebrities. They do normal shit like the rest of us. They get pregnant, they go shopping, they buy shit. They have jobs, they have lives. But because they're famous, somehow we give a shit. Now, if my girlfriend's never got pregnant, you'd be like, Oh my god, Josh, what the hell's wrong with you, you sick bastard? You can't afford to take care of the baby, what the hell? Where's your SSI now? Uh, what's Chris gonna do? Is he gonna be the adopted uncle? Uh, uh. No. But I can admit, I have celebrities I look up to. Danny Filth and Ozzy Osbourne. My idols, my respect. These guys are fucking awesome, man. Oh my god. Yes! Dear God amongst men. Awesome musicians. Bar on there, Paul Hitler, guitarist, great old fella. Awesome. Randy Rhodes, man, dude. Props. One of the best damn guitarists ever, dude. Man, untimely playing crash. Damn. Which, by the way, is detailed in. Where the fuck did I put it? Oh my fucking god. Seriously, it was. No, 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 this is not happening. Fuck. Um. Really? Hold that song. Which is detailed in I Am Ozzy is an awesome bio- autobiography, and Ozzy is the Prince of Darkness, man. Fucking awesome. Read it, good read, it, check it out. It's not going to be on Oprah anytime soon, but maybe it has, I don't know. Anyway, back to the story. Expecting her first child with boyfriend Kanye West. The rapper spilled the. Okay, what is it with the Kardashians, man? Are you dancing as black or a football player or a rapper? It's like, okay. They have their tastes, obviously. I'm not saying they go for a douchebag like me, but I'm just saying that, uh, who cares? It's their life. Beans during his Atlantic City concert on Sunday night, when he stopped the music during his song Lost in the World and asked concert goers, can we make some noise for my baby mama? The Kardashian family is thrilled about the news. Since the Courtney tweet, been wanting to shout from the rooftops with joy, and now I can. Another angel to welcome to our family, overwhelmed with excitement. And Mama Chris says, I'm a happy girl. Wow, the whole baby. What's next? Let's follow the kid and watch him go through high school. Hey, is your mom Kim Kardashian? Oh my god, dude, she's so hot. 
Shut the fuck up, all of my mom, you son of a bitch. I will kick you in your nuts, you motherfucker. <laughs> well, if you have another kid, it's like, oh, now they're competing for attention. Oh my god, I could just see it now. Keep me up with the Kardashians. Part 2 Kim Kardashian's baby drama life. <laughs> okay, who the fuck writes this shit? I would rather watch a dog taking a shit in the park. It'd be more entertaining and at least there's build up. Will it come out? Will it stick back in? Will he walk up and poop somewhere else? Let's find out. Fido takes a shit at 9. Only on E News. Okay, this is, um. Ryan Seacrest with uh, the newest update. Fido and did, in fact, take a shit. It had a little struggle, but with a little bit of push and effort, Fido made that fecal matter come out of his rectum. And then the dog came and stepped in and licked his butt. It's so compelling! Oh my god, it's amazing! Baby, baby. The excited mother to be writes on her blog, it's true. Kanye and I are expecting a baby. We feel so blessed God and, help us all. and wish there that in no addition God. to both of our families, okay, his mom debatable. and my dad There's could be here to celebrate religion. this special time with us. Looking forward to That's great beginnings time. in 2013. Yeah, I'm going to laugh my fucking ass off if the baby comes out white. He's kind of going to be like, oh, hell no. Who are you sleeping with? Oh, um, Kim Kardashian be like, Marshall Mathers. You slept with Eminem? Oh, girl, what the hell? Seriously? Why'd you do that? I can't help it. You don't come slim shady for nothing. Chicka, 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 what? Slim shady be like, I'm back. Oh. What's Kim gonna say? Which Kim? Oh, see what I just did there? I made a pun. God, that is awesome. Okay, back to the video. And to starting a family. Happy New Year. The hmm. pair of his friends. Also, Snooki was pregnant at one point. Okay, do you see that trend here? Now, what we see on TV with their stupid bullshit reality shows, all drinking, partying, and up doing stupid shit with their lives that we, for some reason, like to watch. I hope that they can set a good example for their parent, for their offsprings, their parents can, but if they can't, what the fuck are we gonna do with our lives? Absolutely nothing. We're gonna sit there and watch like mind numbing idiots. <gasps> so, what are they gonna do next? What's well, up to the Kardashians? Files fecal matter on at night, only on E News. Awesome, this shit's fucking awesome, right? Oh yeah, I went there. It's for years and went public with their romance back in April. The E Star is about. It's like, okay, we're official, we're a couple now. Like, who the fuck cares? People, normal people, do the shit all the fucking time. With their friends. Oh yeah, you know the girl I hooked up with at the bar. Yeah, we're a couple now. Oh, that's so cool. You two have a lot in common. You guys are awesome together, right? Cool. No, because someone famous. It has to be a big deal. Like I'm making into it right now. I'm a disgusting hypocrite. I know. I'm just having a laugh at it because it's pathetic that we care this much about what celebrities think and do. <gasps> Says the guy who should stay for the house. I was like, fuck you. Okay, this is music. Okay, this is the existence of life, man. The existence of life. Music has been around longer than Kim Kardashian has been. So, what's next? Maybe her son goes. I want to follow him. Listen to my daddy and make music. <laughs> you know, I'll turn the crap out of my voice and have some spacey synth to it, because it'll be the future, man. We'll all fly around. George Jetson guys meet Kim Kardashian. His boy, Elroy. Daughter, Judy. Jane West, his wife. Jetson, you're fired! Aww. If I show you my sex tape, will you hire me? Hmm. Okay. You're hired. Sweet. I'm back. Wow. I completely lost my marbles. I don't have marbles. Hmm. I have cojones. So, whatever. 12 weeks along for the latest on Kim and Kanye's baby news, head over to E Online. So, there you have it, folks. Kim Kardashian is having a baby. Oh my fucking god. The shocking conclusion to who the fuck cares? It's like, dude, the possibilities are endless, man. Oh my god. <laughs> 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 the 
The last thing we need is the more <laughs> mainstream pop repopulating. It's like, dude, seriously. Anyway, what are your thoughts on Kim Kardashian having a baby? Good for her. If she can pull her shit together and get her family job sorted out, whatever, and have a stable family and household, good for her. But, honestly, who the fuck cares? It's just a couple having a baby. It happens every day. Just saying. Anyway, continue sipping on some Samuel Adams Cherry Wheat Lager. This is some damn good beer. This is... I only had one bottle's worth, man. Just bullshitting on YouTube, whatever, so... Yeah. And thanks. Before we go, I'll leave you with... the back of the book here. Ozzy quotes and saying... My father always said I would do something big one day. I've got a feeling about you, John Mitchell Osborne, he told me after he'd had a few beers. You're either going to do something very special or you're going to go to prison. And he was right, my little man. I was in prison before I was for my 18th birthday. Here's Ozzy as a kid. Here's Ozzy now. Yeah, it's been a change. So yes, if you have not read this book, it is an amazing read, and it will surprise you. Um, this book, man, I couldn't stop reading it. Like, the minute I picked it up, I was like, must finish. I love to read. Reading is a great way to relax in the evening if you don't want to bullshit on YouTube. Just read a good book, have a good cigar, sit back some, with some beer, and just whatever. Anyway, King with Jeff has for the video. Check out I Am Ozzy. If you have not, just been out for quite some time. If you are an Ozzy Osbourne fan or a Black Sabbath fan or a fan of rock and roll, you will definitely love this book. I loved it. I think you'll like it too. Thanks for watching, and um, I'll see you guys later. Keep with JFS. Peace.